Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. This article comes to you guys from T-Mobile's newsroom. This is another big network update coming out of T-Mobile. So T-Mobile and Governor Landry revealed $290 million 5G network upgrade in Louisiana. So since 2021, T-Mobile has been very busy investing across the entire state of Louisiana, and it's starting to show in, in the numbers. So T-Mobile is again making more investments, enhancing the network. And this is also starting to trickle into the small market and rural areas. And that's the biggest concern that Verizon and AT&T have had since the beginning of the merger, that T-Mobile would effectively be able to compete now in these small markets and rural areas. And although they haven't really publicly acknowledged that T-Mobile is a threat now, it is happening right in front of our eyes. So the Uncarrier's network investment brings faster speeds and more coverage in greater New Orleans and dozens of small and rural communities across the state. Again, there goes to Smira again, small market rural areas. And there's also some maps that are listed here. So this is T-Mobile's coverage in 2021 in Louisiana. As you can see, they had some ultra capacity 2.5. They have coverage there but still some, some gaps, right? So now we fast forward to 2024, as you can see a lot more 2.5 across the state and the gaps are getting smaller. So they're still there, but they're, they're getting smaller. So the coverage is expanding as time goes on. So now we look to, if we go to a similar time frame, we go through 2027, those gaps should be even smaller and perhaps 2.5 even at a greater scale. So this is very interesting to keep track of. T-Mobile is updating us consistently on updates and upgrades and, and scale that they're gaining in these states. We saw Texas, Virginia, West Virginia, and several North Carolina uh, in, in these past few months. And now we're seeing Louisiana. You know, we'll see who's next. Nebraska, Kansas, who knows? And then there's also Another comparison, this is T-Mobile's coverage in New Orleans as of 2021. As you can see, they had pretty decent scale already with 2.5. And then fast forward to 24, a lot more 2.5 across New Orleans. So T-Mobile is continuing to work and they're investing into these states. So these are some of the, the, the areas that have received immediate benefit of this of these upgrades so you guys can pause or check the check the link in the for this uh, article in the description and then there's also this auction 108 helped out uh results in louisiana this is from open signal i'll just read this off here briefly in an in an initial analysis ran by third-party experts at open signal following auction 108 t-mobile's overall network and 5g specific download speeds in new orleans jumped over 20 percent faster than before and statewide the uncarriers uh, jumped over 31% faster as well. So they increased speeds across the state without even having to touch sites. Sites that already had 2.5 radios were just, you know, like they said, a flip of a switch. It was a software upgrade and they got more 2.5 bandwidth and they got 31% faster across the state. So they were already faster, but now they increased that by 31 more percent. So just take that into consideration. With these upgrades, T-Mobile is ready to meet the increased demand for wireless connectivity and to continue providing a top-notch network coverage for the people of Louisiana. So T-Mobile is now in the position to continue to grow the, the base in, in the metro, right, in New Orleans and, and, and other areas. And, of course, in the small market rural areas because they have made that significant $290 million investment over the three-year period. So I'll leave this for you guys to check out. In the in the description down below again this is a this is a massive advancement for t-mobile i hope we continue to see this across other states as well in in the in the coming months and years and i hope it really makes a big difference difference for t-mobile as it comes to continuing to gain share continuing to grow uh provide better connectivity 5g advanced whatever it may be i hope it helps t-mobile continuing to compete for fwa customers against cable and everything else so let me know your thoughts in the comments like share subscribe if you're new follow my social media outlets this is tyrone with tech live see y'all in the next one peace